For years, the debate has raged on about the existence of a mysterious 10th, or 9th depending on your age, planet in our solar system. Yes, Pluto was once in the mix, but those days are unfortunately long gone. Yet, whispers of an elusive extra planet persist, often accompanied by tales of aliens and other strange conspiracies. However, recent scientific findings hint that there might be something substantial to these whispers. Back in 2015, Caltech researchers conducted a study which highlighted the feasibility of a hidden celestial body lurking deep within our solar system. This hypothetical planet, possibly 10 times the mass of Earth and orbiting far beyond Neptune, could take 10 to 20,000 years to complete a single orbit around the Sun. Well, it seems the behavior of the objects within the Kuiper Belt defy conventional explanation. Instead of scattering chaotically, they maintain a curious clustering. Some, like those at Caltech, subscribe to the idea that the resonant coupling with a distant planetary mass is the culprit. Fast forward nearly a decade and those same Caltech researchers are back with new insights. This time, they're tracking the movements of long period objects, or LPOs, like comets, that venture past Neptune's orbit. Their sophisticated computer models, accounting for a myriad of variables, including the galactic tide, hint at a gravitational interference from a massive, unseen planet. Basically, the objects they are monitoring should be displaying more erratic behavior. However, they maintain a unique orbit that can most likely be explained by the pull of a gravitational force beyond the reaches of our known solar system. Now, let's not jump to conclusions. The team acknowledges alternative explanations, but they firmly assert the likelihood of a hidden planetary body. But what does this all mean? Does this add credence to the Nibiru Cataclysm theory? For those of you unaware, there exists a vocal minority that insists a large planetary body collided with Earth long ago. This collision was the event in which jettisoned a piece of Earth into space, which was ultimately trapped by the planet's gravitational pull and became our moon. The theory also includes talk of extraterrestrials and individuals receiving alien messages predicting the end of our world due to Nibiru's appearance and that would cause Earth to experience massive and sudden pole shifts because why not? But back here in reality, all we can do is wait. Sometime next year, the Vera Rubin Observatory in Chile will open. According to the Caltech team, that observatory will be capable of searching for and identifying the existence of an object lurking in the shadows of our solar system. If one exists.